we were we were youngsters. We got married and uh, or met in high school, and uh, Mainland High School. And uh, she came from a big family. I came from just I just had a brother, so it was very unique uh, for me to all of a sudden be affiliated with uh, uh, her big family, which was six. She had six brothers and sisters. She was young, cute, and uh, she was available, so uh, we started going out with each other. And most of the time, uh, they're being young, we mostly dated in church. Yeah. At a New Year's Eve party. But, uh, sorry to say, I had my eye on a different girl. But uh, later, a few days later, uh, it turned out to be a blind date. I came home from the Navy for, for a Christmas break, I believe it was, and uh, went out and bought a ring and went over to her house, picked her up, and I couldn't wait to get home to my parents to show them the ring, and I, st I stopped along the side of the road and proposed to her. <laughs> Real romantic. <laughs> <laughs> well, he was very good looking, and, <laughs> and a lot of the girls at church was after him, and one of them said, if you go out with me, you can drive my convertible. And Ray says, I'm sorry, but I like Mary Land. Mm -hmm. So he didn't do it. We have fun together. We've always had fun together. That was the first thing that I think I remember about when he was a teenager, and um, was we always had fun together. We just gravitated to each other because um, no matter what we were doing, we, we enjoyed being together. <laughs> yeah, there was this one time uh, we were sitting around the dinner table and tensions were high. I don't know what, what the problem was, but uh, we were all pretty quiet and Mary had fixed a salad <clears throat> and I picked up the dressing not knowing the cap was loose, and I give it a shake. And that's what broke the ice. Mary had dressing all over her face, dripping down her nose, and we all sit there laughing. Uh, the kids are, they, they knew that something was wrong and they shouldn't laugh, but they couldn't help it, yeah. Oh, we didn't always, we didn't always agree, but we always, with the kids and everything, we always had the philosophy. United we stand, divided we fall. We had three kids, zap, zap, zap. So, I mean, they could get you. I love my wife because she's so understanding and uh, she's always there when I need help or if I'm sick, she's always there to help me get better. Or anything that I do, she's right there with me. He said before, I like to change things around a lot and he goes along with me. And a lot of husbands wouldn't allow a wife to do all of that, but he's a good sport. I'm gonna keep him for 56 more years. <laughs> Her smile. <laughs> and she really has a, a, a deep caring for other people. And, but that smile really got to me. And still does to this day. <laughs> so many things. He's the calming in our home, he's um, the strength in our home. Um, he's still my best friend. I love doing things with him. If I'm going shopping, I'll say, please come with me. I just like being with you, and it's true. I, I love being with him. We enjoy doing things together. We try to talk out everything that we do, and we do everything together ever since we've been married almost. Uh, we work 21 years together every day, seven days a week. And, uh, but uh, whenever we'd have a disagreement, we'd try to never go to sleep with uh, any disagreements on us. Like I said before, just take your vows seriously and be committed. That the whole world, the, the secret is commitment. Just to persevere in prayer. We have learned this over the years. We have. You know, we have prayed about everything together. Um, just, you know, I just know that God cares about everything. He cares about the hairs on our head. He's certainly gonna care about our kids, our grandchildren. But uh, now, today, as I look back, 
I wished I had known the Lord was always there for us. And I can see that now for sure. But I would just advise anyone uh, that, that's young, that is married and looking for children or has children, no, no, the Lord's there. Turn to the Lord and keep that positive attitude that you get through anything that way. Uh, we're Bill and Lois Sands, and we've been married 56 years. Actually, uh, just past our 56th year. Fit. Yeah. We're the McDonough's. I'm Ray. She's Mary. We've been married uh, 56 years. I'm Roger Ray, this is my wife Mary, and we've been married for 57 years in April. We're Bob and Betty Ripley, and we've been married almost 57 years. <laughs>